Welcome to the bowels, or just, no, no the, just bowels of the ocean. You could say the, but I mean, it's not the real title. But yeah, Bowels of the Ocean, indie horror game, or short indie horror game about ocean shit. So if you have a fear of being deep in the oceans, well, be careful, because we're going to do it. And yeah, let's, just, let's just get into it. It calls to me in the night in my dreams. I try to ignore it, but it hungers. I must feed it. Objective, enter the temple. Let's see, right click to zoom, huh? Always oh, slowly move. Tab to toggle map. Uh, well, I mean, if the temple's in the center, then sure, we'll go towards... We have a spear gun, it looks like, so we have to find out what it is that could possibly attack us, I guess. Swimming faster will alert fish from... F wait. F fish? What... what fish are... Th how... how big are the fish? What fish are they talking about? I don't see anything. Which is a good thing, because if we see something, that means something probably sees us. Alright, well... fine. Well... We'll move at a normal pace. We talk. Finally, you have arrived. To begin, kill and bring me five fish. Huh? Oh yeah, the Gamestore page did say it basically was inspired by a few things, one of them being Feed Me Billy, aka the game by Papa Combo. The general areas of fish are marked on the map. Gotcha. Ugh, now something's in my eye. Okay. So, I just gotta go over here. If we move a little faster, so at least the fish right now, supposedly, are... You know, they're not... How fast is our gun? We'll move a little closer. I'm not sure how fast our spear gun is, how much delay there is, or how long it would take, or how easily scared the fish are, but let's see. <gasps> just, oh, oh. Yeah! Hell yeah! I don't have to go and uh, capture it either. Alright. So we'll just look around, I guess. Look for some fishies. Fishies. You gotta look around the area. Oh. They could be high and low, so I'd have to look. The problem then would be if I do use shift, I'll just scare them away and then it would just make it so the game's longer and longer. Ah, there you are. Hell yeah. There's a little delay, as we'd expect. It's not it's not gonna be shooting bullets. We're underwater. We're shooting what probably is like par yeah, so, sort of invisible, sort of not. A little bit a little delay, but nothing too crazy. Um I'm not sure if this is just like roughly all the fish that'd be in this area. Could be two in one area and three in the other, so I'll swim to the other side, because I don't see anything else. Nor anything above me. So we're gonna go West. Got that one. I wasn't even in the area, just like, basically, I guess the map is just telling me where roughly the fish are to be found, or at least some will always be found. But from one place to the other, can, there can be fish anywhere. Hmm? Ooh, big one. He didn't even get scared. Thank you. Boom. Thump. I just love that it just goes, like, thump. Let's see, so there's one... I swear I saw a little sparkle around there. Hmm, guess I was seeing things. It's a little this way in there. Oh, oh there it is. Oh, he stopped moving! Okay, well... Hell yeah, make offering. Sure. You never know. There could be giant fish that come later. That's probably what will happen, but we'll see, we'll see. A fine start, but they were easy prey. I now request larger, smarter, and more alert fish. K 
kill five big fish, if that isn't too difficult for you. Alright, uh, so these quote-unquote big fish will be over here. They're more alert, so I'm guessing they will be more... Oh, Ooh, wait, wait. Big, big fish. I will catch you, the big fish. I'm a pro shooter. Oh, big fish. Oh, pretty big fish. More big fish. Hell yeah. Two more to go. Easy. I am a hunter. Circles are hunters. For obviously it would translate in a video game. Now, where are those last two? Yeah, let's, if we go left, we should find... Oh, wait. Big fish. No, he started moving. Thump. Ah, one more. Big fish in the horizon. Thump. Excellent. Those big fish were nothing. But things are only going to escalate, I'm sure. We'll see, we'll see. Again. Alright. Very impressive, but your final task will not be one of skill but rather of the lengths that you are willing to go to go wait, willing to go to for me kill three divers your own species and bring them to me not the di the nice fellow scuba divers ah uh, well i did say hunt i'm a hunter so i mean if that is what i'm hunting i, I guess will they be on the surface rather Scuba man, look at him swim. <laughs> he just takes a harp. He fucking shrinks. That's pretty funny. I mean, uh, wait, uh, wait, uh, wait uh, at their fellow scuba divers. Let me see if they work like fish AI. Do they get startled and swim away when I get near them? I'd be hell. <laughs> get the fuck back here. <laughs> like, oh, a fellow scuba diver. Oh god, scuba diver. They start panicking like they're fucking scared fish and or deer. Like you step on a twig and the deer gets startled. But it's a human scuba diver. I mean, for all you know, or for all, for all they know, you're just a scuba diver looking and hunting fish. Why would they get startled by you? They're like, oh god, a fellow scuba diver, that's so scary, I'm swimming away. It's like... <laughs> when the scuba divers have fish AI programming. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Dead. <gasps> oh, that's funny. I mean, like, if they were too easy and they didn't swim away, I mean... I don't know if it would be appropriate to have them swim away like that. Unless, like, they saw you murder a scuba diver. But they don't know. But they swim around, like, away from you. It just, it's... I don't know, it's weird, it's unrealistic. Scuba divers don't swim in fright from each other. They'll be like, oh, hey, 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 sup, they'll maybe wave or, you know, blow bubbles at them. But, you know, it just gets started like fish, it's hilarious. You've done, you've done all that I have asked, I am very pleased. Now come to me, child. Okay. Hmm. I mean, I didn't like the whole teeth situation. I mean, you just want to eat me. Oh, he's got like this. He's got like this squid, squid jaw, or squid. Uh, what what are they call? The squid uh, beak. Or octopus? I can't remember. I think it's squid. Yeah. Uh, under the crash of waves, below the jagged rock and crumbled sand, this ancient and evil power devours another of its victims. It waits. It hungers in the bowels of the ocean. Hmm. Developed by Blake McKinnon. The same developer. My score. I don't know what constitutes score, but I don't know if it's really relevant. But yeah, it was made by the same person who made. The most recent one I played was the White Tail Incident, the one where it's like the person got turned into a deer. The other one being. Sleigh bells that I remember playing, or at least I played the demo of that. I can't remember if I played the full version or not. 
But yeah, uh, that was that. Uh, that was uh, Bowels of the Ocean. Eh, interesting little horror, horror game. I, I still say maybe you should not make it so the divers, the scuba divers, have fish AI. Maybe because it's not like they're challenge based. I mean, it's like the game isn't obviously made where accuracy and shooting things is based on accuracy, like a deer hunting game sort of thing. So, I mean, if the humans were programmed to react as a human would or a regular scuba diver, I'm sure it wouldn't remove the difficulty or, you know, the the immersion of the game. But that, that's just my own take, that then getting startled by a fellow scuba diver is hilarious. Because it's not like we're a monster or anything, not that, not, not that we're aware. We're just a scuba diver who's stupidly listening to some kind of maleficent or omnipotent monster that you know, exists beneath the ocean. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed anyways. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and hit the subscribe button, become a full subscriber. Hit the notification down below for updates to my videos. Thank you for watching, and until the next time. Rawr.